peace, 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 family. I am Z the Empress, and I am back with your end of June love reading for the sign of Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Please feel free to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment if it resonates with you. Please, my, please be mindful that this is a general reading. Um, so it may or may not resonate with you, which is completely fine. Okay. So let's just jump into it, guys. So, love is in the air. Love is in the air, Taurus. Especially for you. Okay, so we have the Five of Pentacles. We have the Page of Cups. And we have the Nine of Cups. Okay, so I feel like you are either in or were in a... In a relationship you didn't want to be in. Point blank period. You might have felt like you were left in the cold. Um, you were struggling. You were suffering with this person. Um, physically, emotionally, and financially. It just... This person or this relationship really set you back. Instead of helping you progress, or it, it did nothing. This this relationship with your ex, or with the past lover, it did nothing positive for you. It's the, it, it's not even beneficial for you in, to be in it. You know, to the point where you're like, why am I even here? You know, like what am I doing? And then it's like all of a sudden, you know, you wake up. Or you get fine and, you know, you go outside one day, you smelling good or whatever, and then it's like, boom. Look, boom. I don't know if you can see it. You know, Page of Cups energy. It could be a younger person, or you could be young. You know, the person could be older than you, or you um, older than this person. Okay? <coughs> oh, excuse me. Okay? But... These are, um, you have the Nine of Cups as well. It's really good energy. Probably someone that's very stable. You know, because I feel like you're coming from an unstable situation and you want stability. You know, you want to be stable with someone. So I feel like this is more stable for you guys. Yeah, I feel like this is a more stable relationship. It's a happy relationship. You guys have chemistry. You got chemistry. But you got to release your ex. Okay? The time has come for you to clear your energy. In order for you to, to get this energy, this Nine of Cups energy, you got to release your ex. And you have to let go of control issues. You know? Um, yeah. You got to... Hold on. Let me... up a little bit okay alrighty so yeah you gotta let go of control issues um let go of the past all those emotions your thought patterns and everything because by holding on to your past it can affect your future it can damage your future you know what I'm saying so you don't want to bring old baggage from your previous relationship um, to to a new one, okay. Um, don't mind my water in the back <laughs> either. But yeah, so yeah, I mean it's it's an overall pretty good reading for you guys. Um, I feel like it's new love and romance is coming your way. You're gonna have a lot of chemistry, but you know, here's the thing though. What I get, I don't get that it's new, a new person though. I said new love or something, but I don't think it's a new person. I think it's it may be someone from your past that you you've dealt with, but y'all may have never been in a relationship. You always had a crush on each other, or you know you've had dealings with this person, but you've never really been in a relationship with this person. So you might run into this person or you might talk to this person and message this person y'all messaging back and forth and it may send you in 
into a place where you're like, what if, you know, I wonder what it would be like with this person. What it would it be like to be in a relationship, you know, with this person. You feel me? So, um, yeah. And that's what it is, you know. So, but anyways, the last card I got for you guys, it says the only thing that is real is love. Shift your focus from the prob from the problem back to love. Taurus. It's a beautiful card too. See that? It's like them against the world, you know? Like nothing else exists. I feel like you may have a child with this person too. Like y'all gonna you may um Nine of Cups represents marriage as well. So you may get married. This may be your future husband or wife coming. The person that you've been waiting for. You know, for my single Taurans. You know, you may have been waiting or you've been trying to manifest, you know, this person. And they're coming. They're coming for you. Okay? With open arms. And they're everything you've ever wanted. It's going to be beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, this person may be, um, may have money, you know, they may, they may be very secure financially, okay, and willing to take care of you or, or to help you, you know, y'all help each other, you know, so, but I just wanted to read what the book says about this card, because I think it's nice, um, it says, we are conditioned to dwell on problems, the true reality is love, make the choice now, to take a deep, uh, make a, make the choice now, excuse me, to take a deep breath and focus on what is true. Negativity will disappear once you affirm everything is okay. I choose love. I like that. Choose love. Every time. Love wins. Every time. Choose love. And see how far it gets you. Alright, Taurus. So, um, that's pretty much it. All I have for you guys now for the end of June. Um, this should be good for June 25th through the 30th, okay? So, um, like, share, and subscribe to my channel. If it resonates with you, feel free to like or leave a comment. All is love. Until next time, I am Z the Empress. Peace.